Okay, so basically... So basically I forgot to record my process of making my monarch butterfly dress. Oopsies. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna explain and go through the process with you of how I made it, I guess. Okay, here we go. Let's try and explain this. So I took this orange fabric and I wrapped it around my mannequin. You can see there is the other end that I <laughs> wrapped around. And underneath that corner that I took, I put Velcro under, so then it would easily, it would be easy to put on and off without, but it covers the Velcro up. I hope I'm, yeah, hope you understand. <laughs> Since I got like three or four yards of this orange fabric, I think it was three, it obviously went down more. And I turned that into a train, like that, and I painted the edges and painted some detailing to make it kind of like a butterfly wing, as well as adding a corset, a black corset in the middle to cinch my waist. I also added a sleeve to the side, and I made it look like a butterfly wing, so that yeah, it could be the monarch butterfly I've been wanting. And also, I made a headpiece, kind of like that. And it's supposed to be like one bigger wing and one smaller wing of a uh, butterfly on both, on uh, either side. And I didn't like how that kind of turned out in, like, like actually. So I decided to make a prosthetic uh, piece that I can attach to my eye so it would give more volume and length to even out the wing. Yeah, I think it looks good. Now let's see it on my body. Okay, play the music. So what is your eye? 